So a lot of my subscribers are like, hey, you should do the cinnamon challenge because everybody on the internet's doing it. That's like the super cool thing that everyone is doing right now. And at first I was like, man, that's that's really dumb. Why would I do that? But hey, give the people give the people what they want, okay? So I've got my spoon here and I've got my water for when I'm done. I understand that you can't drink water during or can you do it before I don't know I think that's against the rules but after you finish I would assume that you're allowed to drink water make sure I'm gonna just look it up a little bit look at some other videos and read about it maybe check out the Wikipedia because apparently there is a Wikipedia page for the cinnamon challenge which is like that's how you know you, that's how you know something's big when it has its own Wikipedia page. Cinnamon challenge is a challenge that became an internet meme in which a person attempts to eat or swallow a tablespoon full of ground cinnamon in under 60 seconds without drinking anything. While the challenge appears to be very simple, it is actually very difficult because the cinnamon quickly dries the mouth, making swallowing difficult. Okay, that's about what my thought safety concerns. Some have advised against performing this stunt because it may be possible to choke on the cinnamon or to accidentally inhale it due to the presence of a moderately toxic component called coumarin. European health agencies have warned against consuming large amounts of cinnamon. Well, a tablespoon isn't really a large amount, is it? Some challenges report that the cinnamon is especially unpleasant and that its dust is comparable to pepper spray. Advise that you consult a physician before and after completing the challenge. It could result in dizziness, runny nose, hallucinations may occur, increased sexual urges, benign but dangerous liver tumors, nausea, psychotic nightmares, depressed mood, trouble concentrating, sleep problems, suicide ideation. What does that even mean? Seizure, severe pain in your upper stomach spreading to your back, Nausea and vomiting, fast heart rate, explosive diarrhea. Fuck you guys. I actually just joined the gym like two weeks ago. And prior to that, I had not stepped foot in the gym in like five years. So as you can imagine, I'm very out of shape. And after every workout, I feel like I've been jumped by a group of hooligans with baseball bats but hopefully my stamina and strength will increase over time and maybe i can even tone up this body a little bit because the way i see it i'm already kind of awesome and sort of cute if i don't say so myself so imagine if i had a toned body as well i'm about to be so fucking sexy